I grew up near Cannock um, and I started playing hockey when I was six, so quite young. My first club was Cannock Hockey Club. My mum took me down on a Thursday night and said, just give it a go. I never even really heard of the sport and just thought, I'll, I'll see what it is, see what it's about. And I was there from the age of six up until 16, so I spent a good 10 years of my life there and couldn't have been where I am without them. It was incredibly surreal. I never even expected to be in the Commonwealth team at the time I was. Um, it worked out perfectly. To come into the squad initially was amazing. To then hear that I was selected for the games was a really special moment. We went into the tournament with massive goals, coming off the back of the World Cup, feeling confident. And as a team, I think we were in a really good place. Game to game, it got better. And in the final, I think everyone was so up for it and realised what was in front of us, the opportunity to win a gold medal. And here is Peel. Peel off the right foot. Here is Hunt, shoots, scores! And England are in front. Holly Hunt on Martin to the top of the circle. Every single one of us on the pitch gave it our all. We knew what we could do. We knew we could do it in front of a home crowd who backed us all the way and really got us over the line. Um, and when that full-time whistle went, we knew we had made history and it was one of the best feelings of my life. It's all over! And England are the Commonwealth Games champions in Birmingham in 2022. For the first time in their history, they will stand on the top step of the podium in the women's hockey. I really can't put it into words, the feeling. It's something I don't think I'll ever get back just because it was in front of so many friends and family. Um, I'd been on that pitch so many times, made my Premier League debut on that pitch. I scored my first ever Premier League goal on that pitch. And I've been playing there for five years now, so I think to be able to do probably the biggest moment in my career in that place with all my family and friends around was incredibly special. And I don't think I could have picked a better place to do it. I think more than anything, it's just given me a hunger to want more. I think there's many aspirations. One is to just keep enjoying playing hockey and the sport. Um, and then for every athlete, it's got to be the Olympics. So doing what I can to hopefully maybe one day go to an Olympics, but also the next Commonwealth Games in Victoria. Yeah, I think they're two of my biggest aspirations.